Yo, what's up, everybody? What's up, YouTube? Okay, uh, back part two of the news. Um, I'm gonna do about this news about this dude. Um, this team was shot with um killing 16 year old Trent Vincent Jr. on the screen. Could it um? Okay, I probably do my gun news about this uh story that happened on uh, last year. So here we go. Okay, they arrested teenager um, you know, who shot with murder with this this um 16 year old. Boy, last year around December, uh, ties twenty one. So, um, so the victim was on um, was name was on um, Trent Vincent Jr. So he was a sixteen year old boy who um was shot to death on um Collarwood, which is off of South South um, Boulevard. And so I think they got so so I believe the two um teens you know got to the fight or little the argument and how this dude. Um, had shot and killed this teenager, and um, so yeah, they arrested him. I think yesterday for the murder that happened um way back last year, and so so I believe this this argument has stemmed from you know beefing, but I think beefing can really can be a way to where you know someone can get murdered over that right there, but um, but so I believe the team you know and you know, I think got to a little argument with another team. And how things went, you know, went bad. How you know, one life was lost. And so I think, like the teenager, um, yeah, I think they have an um, at least name of the teenager who got charged with the murder. But um, so I believe, so I, so I do think this 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 theme of the argument or a little beefing that went on in the hood. But and so so I feel like the teenager is. Basically, it's gonna do adult time for murder, man, for real. And so I think he, I, uh, let me see, I think he, I think he kills. Um, hold on. So, let me. So I'm trying to say a different way. Okay, let's say evil teenager, right? You know, basically, uh, you know, you kill another teenager means that you probably might do adult time in prison. You know, adult, you know, like all years need to life in prison, but. And so I think he probably uh is seventeen year old, eighteen year old now, because he, you know, got shot with this crime, and so that might give him basically life in prison. And so, so I think Alabama law means that you know if you turn into you know crime like murder means that you know you're going to do adult time in prison, you know, adult years. And so it, so it depends on the crime might you know had occurred, but so I think he might do. So I think he probably might do some dope use in prison, man. Cause he, you know, a juvenile on how like like some juveniles I said can't get life though for murder and um things like other crimes, but and so I think and so I think the teenager had, you know, trying to kill Trent Vincent. How Trent Vincent was a you know uh I said innocent um sixteen year old. Man, I feel like it's a tragedy event to happen, man, to where, you know, one person lost a life to violence and how violence, you know, it can affect families in a whole way. I think this about how, <coughs> how the two men, two boys, who just, you know, got to the a little dispute, man, how eight things, you know, had went ugly and how one teenager had lost his life to the on gun. And how gun violence, you know, it can be main problem in the black community. You, you know, if you're a person who you know, lastly, you know, a son or old either a daughter of violence means that these these parents are grieving the loss, but and so I feel like, you know, like his parents is basically grieving basically the loved ones towards violence how violence can be a number one reason to um, reason to where, you know, young people nowadays are carrying guns now because they you know, they want to feel tough. Because guns can be a power. And so I think guns can, you know, have power over the men who murdered and slaughtered teenagers, you know, young adults in the hood. But and so I feel like, you know, like the young men, you know, basically nowadays are carrying guns it's by them at the tough in the streets, you know, or being too too wild with it, everything. And so I think gun laws in my state is getting like too out of control to where Yeah. They say like um yeah, uh, so I think I said, you know, about gun laws in my state to where, 
you know, you can carry the gun, you know, you know, as long as it's not um, used for any type of crime, you know, you're good, but, and so I think the gun laws in, like, probably in states can be uh, affecting the people that got killed by guns and stuff, but, and so I think gun violence, it can be the number one um, route to where, you know, how black people get angry quick, and, you know, by, you know, by they carry guns all the time, you know, how guns, it can, can affect families and people who, you know, lost their guns, um, their son's door to the gun. And so I think, like, these thugs I hear basically want to act, you know, like bad, you know, they want to act tough. You know, I feel like uh, these young dudes, basically, yeah, I feel like they got front to prove in the streets. You know, I feel like, you know, they, like, like, then your dudes is probably 20 years old, 19, 18, 21, 22. You know, they want to, you know, have the guns to show out with, you know, you know, or to add more, more vision with it, you, you know, to where they want to kill, you know, innocent people though out here. Because it's more about safety in your life too, but, and so I feel like, you know, the dude killed this, this um, 16 year old um, boy and how his family is mourning his death, man, but, um. So I feel like you know it's more of a, you know of a tragic thing to hear about you know a kid gets killed in the hood or you know a teenager gets shot, and so uh so I feel like it's a bad thing to like you know hear about a man you know a teenager gets killed. So um man, it's more of a tragic story though to have last year and how this teenager got charged with the murder man of his of his um, teenager though, but so sad though, but. So make sure you like, comment, and subscribe. So peace. I'm out here. Take care.